Welcome to Popular History. Today, we're traveling back to the 13th century, an era of lords, knights, and of course, the awe-inspiring stone sentinels of their realms, the castles. So sit tight as we unveil the secrets of castle construction in the 13th century and its absolute history. Imagine yourself in medieval Europe. The scent of fresh earth and stone fills the air as the grandest structures of the time rise from their foundations. Castles were not just homes for nobility and monarchs. They were symbols of power, fortresses of defense, and hubs of daily life. But how were these colossal edifices built with the technology of the 13th century? It all began with meticulous planning, where castle architects known as master masons chose strategic locations crucial for defense, atop hills, beside rivers, or encircled by forests. The construction of a castle was a colossal endeavor requiring the labor of hundreds, from skilled stonemasons to an army of laborers. Quarrymen would excavate stone, the backbone of these structures, often transported from afar due to its superior quality. Foundations were dug deep and filled with rubble and mortar. As the walls slowly ascended, they revealed the innovative techniques of the era. The introduction of ribbed vaults and flying buttresses not only contributed to the structural integrity, but also allowed for taller, more imposing walls. Battlements and arrow slits were cunningly integrated for protection against sieges. Castles were self-contained with halls, chapels, storerooms, and living quarters that spoke volumes of the lifestyle of the nobility. They were more than just military installments. They were microcosms of medieval society with bustling courtyards and craft workshops. The result of this laborious process was the transformation of the landscape as castles punctuated the skyline, integral not only to medieval warfare, but to the cultural and social structure of the time. Their construction has left an indelible mark on history, giving us a tangible link to the lives and ingenuity of our ancestors. And with that, we close the portcullis on today's dive into the secrets of 13th century castle construction. We hope you enjoyed this journey through the absolute history. If you did, please leave a like and hit that subscribe button. Your support is what keeps our history alive. Don't forget to ring the bell for notifications about our latest chronicles from the past. Until next time, thank you for watching Popular History.